Well, 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 this is huge, guys. I have some incredible news to share with you, and you won't believe what I'm about to tell you. It looks like Apple is working on a new device that could make AR more amazing and affordable than ever before. A device that could offer you the ultimate vision without emptying your wallet. That device is the Vision Air. The Vision Air is a new headset that Apple is reportedly developing to bring AR to more people. It's rumored to cost around $1,000, which is still a lot of money, but much more affordable than the Vision Pro, which costs $3,500. And it's supposed to have some impressive specs and capabilities that could make it a worthy alternative to the Vision Pro. But how does the Vision Air compare to the Vision Pro? And what can it do that the Vision Pro can't? Well, that's what we're going to find out in this video. But before we start, make sure to subscribe to my channel for all the latest Apple news and leaks. Now let's get started. First of all, let's talk about the design. The Vision Air is said to have a sleeker and lighter design than the Vision Pro, which is a bulky and heavy device that requires a battery pack to operate. The Vision Air, on the other hand, is supposed to have a built-in battery that can last for hours and a more comfortable fit that can accommodate different head sizes and shapes. The Vision Air is also rumored to have a more discreet and stylish look with a variety of colors and materials to choose from. It might even look like a pair of sunglasses rather than a sci-fi helmet. But the design is not the most important thing. The most important thing is the display. And this is where the Vision Air could really impress. The Vision Air is expected to have a higher resolution and a wider field of view than the Vision Pro, which means that the images and videos you see will be more crisp and realistic, and you'll be able to see more of your surroundings. The Vision Air is also speculated to have a higher refresh rate and a lower latency than the Vision Pro, which means that the motion and interaction will be more smooth and responsive, and you'll feel less motion sickness and eye strain. But how can the Vision Air achieve such a high quality display? while being cheaper and lighter than the Vision Pro. Well, the secret might be in the technology. The Vision Pro uses OLED panels, which are expensive and power hungry, to create the display. The Vision Air, however, might use a different technology called Micro LED, which is cheaper and more efficient to create the display. Micro LED is a new type of display technology that uses tiny LEDs to create pixels rather than organic materials. Micro LED has many advantages over OLED, such as higher brightness, lower power consumption, longer lifespan, and better color accuracy. Micro LED is also more suitable for AR because it can create transparent displays that can blend with the real world. But Micro LED is not easy to make. It requires a lot of precision and expertise, and it's not widely available yet. That's why Apple might have a secret weapon, LuxView. LuxView is a company that Apple acquired in 2014, and that specializes in micro-LED technology. LuxView has been working on micro-LED for years, and has filed many patents and research papers on the topic. LuxView might be the key to making the Vision Air a reality, and giving Apple an edge over the competition. But the display is not the only thing that matters. The Vision Air also needs to have a powerful processor, a high-quality camera, a sophisticated sensor, and a smart software to create the best AR experience possible. And according to the leaks and rumors, the Vision Air will have all of that and more. The Vision Air is rumored to have a custom-made chip called the M1X that will handle all the computing and graphics tasks. The M1X is said to be a more advanced and efficient version of the M1 chip that powers the latest Macs and iPads, and that has impressed everyone with its performance and battery life. The M1X will be able to run complex AR applications and games, and support features like hand tracking, eye tracking, facial recognition, and spatial audio. The Vision Air is also rumored to have a high-resolution camera that will capture the real world and overlay it with virtual elements. The camera will also enable features like video calling, photo and video recording, and live streaming. The camera might also have a depth sensor that will measure the distance and shape of the objects and environments and create a 3D map of the space. This will enable features like occlusion, which means that the virtual elements will appear behind or in front of the real ones, depending on their position. The Vision Air is also rumored to have a sophisticated sensor that will track the movement and orientation of the headset and the user's head and eyes. 
The sensor will also detect the lighting and temperature of the environment and adjust the display accordingly. The sensor will also enable features like gesture control, which means that the user will be able to interact with the virtual elements using their hands and fingers without touching anything. The Vision Air is also rumored to have a smart software that will run the AR applications and games and provide the user interface and the voice assistant. The software will be based on iOS, the operating system that runs on the iPhone and the iPad, and that has millions of apps and developers. The software will also be compatible with the App Store, the Apple Arcade, and the Apple TV Plus, which means that the user will have access to a huge library of content and entertainment. The software will also be integrated with Siri, the voice assistant that can answer questions, perform tasks, and control the devices. Siri will also be able to recognize the user's voice and personalize the experience accordingly. All of these features and components will make the Vision Air a powerful and versatile device that can do a lot of things and do them well. The Vision Air will be able to create immersive and realistic AR experiences that will enhance the user's perception and interaction with the world. The Vision Air will also be able to connect and communicate with other devices, such as the iPhone, the iPad, the Mac, the Apple Watch, and the AirPods, and create a seamless and integrated ecosystem. The Vision Air will also be able to adapt and learn from the user's preferences and behavior, and create a personalized and customized experience. But when will the Vision Air be released? And how much will it cost? Well, that's the big mystery. Apple has not confirmed or denied the existence of the Vision Air and has not given any official information or announcement about it. But based on some leaks and rumors, we can make some predictions. The Vision Air is expected to be released sometime in 2025. That might seem like a long time, but it's actually not that far, considering the complexity and innovation of the device. Apple might also want to wait until the market and the demand for AR devices are more mature and ready and until the technology and the production are more refined and reliable. The Vision Air is expected to cost around $1,000, which is a lot cheaper than the Vision Pro, which costs $3,500. That might seem like a bargain, but it's still a lot of money, and not everyone will be able to afford it. Apple might also offer some financing and trade-in options to make the device more accessible and appealing. Apple might also offer some accessories and services, such as cases, chargers, subscriptions and warranties to enhance and protect the device. So, is the Vision Air worth the wait and the money? Well, that depends on your perspective and your needs. If you're a tech enthusiast, an early adopter, or a professional user who wants to experience the magic of AR and who doesn't mind spending a lot of cash, then the Vision Air might be the perfect device for you. But if you're a casual user, a budget-conscious consumer, or a skeptical observer, who doesn't see the value or the appeal of AR, and who prefers to stick with the traditional devices, then the Vision Air might not be the best choice for you. But whatever your opinion or your decision, you have to admit that the Vision Air is a fascinating and exciting project that could revolutionize the way we see and interact with the world. The Vision Air could be the next big thing, the next game changer, the next killer product. The Vision Air could be the Vision Pro for the masses. And that's all for today's video. I hope you enjoyed it and learned something new. If you did, please give it a thumbs up and leave a comment below. And if you want to see more videos like this, please subscribe to Tech Pulse Pro, the channel where I try to bring you the latest and greatest in tech news and documentaries. Thanks for watching and see you next time.